everyone, I've got a few things to share with you today. Um, I've been unboxing a lot of my dolls, dolls that I've had in box and I've said I'm going to unbox and just haven't gotten around to it. So I'll be showing you a few of those. Also, I've redressed a few of my blithes. I've got a few new blithes. Um, I'm obsessed with these AliExpress Blythe dolls. I love them. I do, honestly. So these are the new ones I've got. I've got this one that's got like a white, almost white blonde hair. It's lovely. Um, she has got the shiny face. I've started leaving a few with shiny faces now, but I think I am going to make hers not shiny. I'm going to put the Mr. Super Clear on her. Here she is. She has the normal eyes and she's got an articulated body, but it was this hair. It's usually the hair that sells me on them. Look at that. Love it. So that was her. Then I got this one. Look at the colour of her hair. It's like a dusky purple, isn't it? Let's get her out and show you. They do, they do come well wrapped and they're in a on top of all this wrapping that they come with they're in a sturdy box so uh, sometimes if I order two together they'll send two in one box which is fine with me here she is look this dusky pink and there's loads of it it's not sparsely rooted at all there is loads of it and it feels nice and soft as well and comes right down past her knees or to her knees gorgeous i will be giving them new eye chips i'm just waiting for some more to arrive and then this is my favorite out of those three i just love it's the hair that sells me on them and she has got oh look at her hair it's absolutely lovely i love that color that like auburn color beautiful and it's cut in a short bob and it's um and she has the matte face which i love yeah and i do like them with a the fringe because you can't then see the the join here i do like mine to have a fringe which is why most of mine have got a fringe so those were those and then i got this girl she is a new one who i haven't shown you before and she's got this lovely candy pink hair hence her name which is candy and i made her this dress love the little dress i thought she needed something pink and um, lots of detail on it so she's got pom-poms ribbon glittery ribbon she's got little angels on her waist ribbon there little heart buttons at the top and then she's got this hat on which i love and it's got a little mouse on it and she's got a little bracelet that i made her but that's her she's gonna get some new eye chips too and i may make her face matte but i love her love the pink hair and she's got beads on her string as well i've given her some pink beads pink and gold beads to match yeah love her so much so that's candy and then i've redressed a couple of my blinds so i've got peaches she's redressed as a hippie doll and these clothes came from a tattoo divas doll um i've had the dolls for ages and done nothing with them so i wanted to try their clothes on the blithes which i did and um i've had to pin the skirt because it was a bit wide but love it love the bag she's got the bracelets too i think it really suits her Should I look at her fluffy um leg warmers are they i think they must be but yeah love that and then the last blithe Thing I have to show you is Amelia. Amelia is my little goth blithe and she's got her, <laughs> she's got another one of the 
tattoo diva's clothes on and I've had to um, pin them at the back. But I thought they suited her really well, my little goth girl. She's got the bracelets on, she's got the big silver bag, she's got the nets on her legs and I gave her those boots. So that's the lovely Amelia. It doesn't matter what I do with Amelia's hair and how many times I brush it, it just is a fluffy mess. But I didn't want to put it in plaits or anything because I think she's far too gothic to be have plaited hair. <laughs> That's my little Amelia. Also from AliExpress, I found this lace. Um, I love it. Love these colours. I thought these colours would go really well with Candy with her pink. Um, so that's what they're for. They're for doll, doll clothes and there's loads of different colours and designs. They're just lovely. Absolutely love it. And it's like a cotton feel lace. They also popped in a couple of little silk roses there. And then there's these rainbow colours. I love these rainbow colours. Look at them. Won't they be nice for Easter? That's what I thought. Thought they would go nice on an Easter dress that I'm planning to make. So that was that. The dolls I've been opening. Honestly, I've got a pile, a mile high nearly. I bet it would be nearly a mile. Well, it wouldn't be a mile high. That's a, that's a, an exaggeration, isn't it? But we've got the uh, American Story series Patriot Barbie to start with. Here is she. And can I find her shoes? No, I can't. I don't know what I've done with them. I'm hoping that they're going to just magically appear because I've lost them. She came with them in a box. I carefully removed them. I put them down somewhere and I cannot find them for the life of me. So, Patriot Barbie has no shoes on. I can find her some shoes though. Her hair is absolutely as stiff as a board. And when I took her out of her box, this feather here should be a lot more... Uh, plush than it is and all these bits have come off you can see they're still coming off and uh, they were all over her velvety feel coat so I had to spend quite a long time getting them off she's got her little ring on there she's got her silky red skirt which is separate from the top and then she's got the ruffle here she's got the stars can see there's a little bit of the hair look as well but she's gorgeous look at her face and her hat is plastic it's actually plastic but that's her she's been unboxed she came with a bell a brush and a little story they come with um, storybooks these american stories dolls do so that was her I've also unboxed this girl, she's a Steffi Love doll, but isn't she pretty in her little dress look with like her rainbow top and her pink glittery bottom. She is very plasticky and she does have the coloured legs and then she's got these shoes, that's her. Then I've got this girl, she is the Swan Lake Odette doll that I got, that I showed you a few videos ago. And she was missing plugs. Someone had cut her hair quite short at the front here. And what I did, I took some hair from the back here where it's really thick and, and lush. And I uh, rerouted the bits that were missing. And now she's perfect. Look at that. And I was told that this is her actual outfit. Her bottoms are still in the wash. She has got them. But yeah, so she, I've, uh, I'm really pleased with how she came out. She's fixed and she's going to go into my collection. So that's her. She really is a beautiful doll. Um, I have two versions of Odette and she is one of my favourite face moulds. I really love how serene and beautiful she is. So that's her. Then I have another one of the American Stories one. This time I have a Civil War Barbie. Civil War nurse. She does have her shoes. I looked after those better than I looked after the Patriot dolls ones, but look how gorgeous she is. She's got her apron on, she's got her nurse's dress, her cape, 
look at her she's lovely and again the seriously stiff hair I may have to uh, wash that hair you can see that her the rubber band that she had in her hair has deteriorated I may wash her hair and put her a, a new band in I'll see her shoes are little black shoes little black slip-on shoes and she did come with her nurse's case and her brush and a little storybook helpful heart it's called next i've got this doll i love her she's the shakira barbie look how gorgeous she is look at her hair i mean her hair is uh, really stiff but i love how crimped and sort of crimped curls i'd call that can see it's curly underneath there gorgeous look at her face she's got her necklace she's got her two layer top on she's got this belt that looks leather and she's got this that looks leather and her trousers too and she's wearing high heel boots so that's her she's gorgeous love her so much love her next we have got the Walt Disney 25th Anniversary Barbie. Here she is. Look at her. She's gorgeous. So she's got her Mickey Mouse ears on. She's got red earrings. She's got her little Mickey Mouse silhouette top on. Her silver jacket with the Mickey there from Fantasia, I believe. Yeah, and it says 25 on there too. She's got her little black shiny skirt and red belt and she's wearing some this is odd to me flat shoes but she's got feet for heels that it's very odd very odd and she also came with a balloon that has a little mickey mouse on it and a little pleather bag that is starting to peel from her being left in a box so it was time she was taken out wasn't it then I have this beauty. She is Barbie as Snow White. She's just gorgeous. Look at her face. Beautiful. She's got like white pearl earrings on. She's got soft, fluffy, a soft, fluffy white collar. She's got this gorgeous bodice with the white glittery detail on it. Then she has her two layer dress, which is met on the top over a silky skirt and then she's got her little blue stiletto heels to match beautiful really lovely and she's actually got on a little pearly ring as well so that's her then i got a couple of outfits from smith's toys it was three three for the price of two so one was a set of pajamas which i wrapped up and put in rose's christmas box this one actually came with a foot cast which i took off and gave to rosie because she loves anything like that so i gave her the cast and the little pen you get with it to write on it and i just kept the the outfit which is the little leggings the sweatshirt and the little unicorn top so that's a cute little top yeah three for the price of two is a really good price it makes them under 10 pounds each then this one this is a nice snuggly one it's got the earmuffs it's got the knitted dress it's got little boots and it's even got tights i do like tights and socks on dolls i don't know why why i'm so obsessed but i do and you can see on here look that she's got here's one of the girls wearing it winter style it says so that was those then this girl she's had her makeover and i've redressed her popped her in this outfit this is the um film runner outfit you know like one of the extras on a film that runs for coffee and things like that yeah so she's got her headphones she's got her little belt with scissors and a pencil in there and she also comes and she's got some little sellotape there and her clapperboard <laughs> yeah she's lovely her hair i've had to put her hair in these um elastics because it's as soon as you brush it 
and move ahead it needs brushing again so I've put it I've elastic it up like this to stop it I've plaited the extendable bit because she is the one whose hair grows so that's her she came out beautiful she's a lovely doll that's her then we've got this girl she is it says on a box I love Barbie and I do love Barbie you know that look at her face she's got a beautiful face she's got those lime green earrings she's got this lovely dress on I love that dress and she has bend and snap knees and partially bent arms with a green ring. Look at her hair. Her hair's lovely. I did replace the elastic because the elastic in her hair had rotted. That's the trouble with keeping dolls in boxes. That's what I thought. I need to get them out. And I thought I'm trying to make some space in my doll room as well. And I'm sorting through all my dolls after Christmas. I mean, I have I had I have put my quite a few doubles on eBay already. After Christmas, I'm gonna have an, an even better sort out and put some more on eBay, some more of the, the ones that I don't really interact with much so that I can buy more of the ones that I do enjoy. So next we have got the graduation Barbie, class of 97. Look at her, her hair is so soft, you know it really is silky soft and she is just gorgeous look at her she's got purple earrings she's got her sash and her gown her mortarboard hat and purple shoes to match and she does have bend and snap knees she's even got her little diploma there look or degree that's her next we've got this gorgeous girl i mean look at her she is bead blast Teresa and look at that hair. It is just wonderful. I love the color of it. I love the length of it. It is silky, silky soft. Look at her face. Isn't she just beautiful? She's got like pink and gold eyeshadow. She's got green eyes. She's got her orange earrings in there, her dress. Like I say, she was new in box. The only problem I'm having is that her shoes keep falling off. So I have put them on and I've bagged them up so that they won't keep falling off. That's what I've done. But isn't she just stunning? And she did come with her pack of beads, her brush and the little tool you need to apply the beads into her hair. So she was, obviously she was complete because she, she was new in box so that's the lovely bead blast Teresa absolutely love her she's just beautiful then we've got pretty flowers Barbie look at her pretty dress it's lovely absolutely love that dress I love the style of it I love the pattern on it she comes with these little yellow shoes her hair comes down to her waist and it again is gorgeous, gorgeous hair, so soft and silky. And she's got such a lovely face, hasn't she? And she comes with her little bag, which has also got flowers on it. So that's the pretty flowers Barbie. She's beautiful, love her. You know what I'm like, I think they're all beautiful. Well, they are, they are all beautiful. Yeah, that's her. And then the final doll for this video is this gorgeous Fashion Avenue Barbie. Look how beautiful she is. She's got her lovely beret on. These are velour, this outfit is. She's got a little daisy there. She's got her orange and pink velour dress on. Love the colour. It's like a buttery orange to me, that is. And then she's got these little flowers decorating her waist. Then she's got these gorgeous net tights and white boots, again, which are very very loose they won't stay on very easily so she again has had the bag over her legs but yeah so that was my dolling for today i hope you enjoyed that thank you for watching bye for now